And that is, if the stabilization on smartphones is so good these days, do you really need a gimbal like this? And I think the answer is yes, as using a gimbal you can get even smoother footage. One of the big benefits of a smartphone gimbal is that it keeps your horizon level no matter what way you are moving. Without one, you run the risk of tilting the camera and capturing a wonky horizon. So instead of the horizon in the distance being a nice flat line, it will tilt either to the left or to the right. And so this adds another level of stabilization to your footage that would be really, really hard to achieve using just a phone. It's possible, but you would have to spend the entire time keeping an eye on your phone screen to make sure the horizon is level, rather than focusing on capturing your subject. Another massive benefit of a gimbal is its ability to track you, which is invaluable as a solo filmmaker. This allows you to get dynamic, moving clips of yourself exploring your location that adds massive production quality to your finished sequences. To be able to achieve this without a tracking gimbal like the iSteady V3, you would need a second additional person to operate your phone's camera. All right, let's take a look at a few examples side by side. Handheld footage from my iPhone 15 Pro Max versus the Hohem iSteady V3 so that you can see the differences between hand holding a phone and using a gimbal so that you can get a feel for just how much smoother the footage can be. So there you have it, that's everything you need to know about the Hohem iSteady V3. A fantastic little gimbal with two standout features in my opinion. The ability to remove the controller to remotely control the gimbal and the AI tracker which doesn't require an app. Over the past few weeks using this gimbal has been a great and fun experience and I have loved having the versatility of tracking in any app due to that independent tracking module. Now if you would like to find out more about the Hohem iSteady V3 or pick it up I will put links in the description down below where you can do just that.